Hi, Josh Apple here with the Raspberry Golf Academy. Today I'm at Virginia Golf Center and I'm going to talk about how to practice. I talk a lot about technique but also how to practice is very important. So today is more of a classroom setting and I'm going to show you an important aspect of practicing and that's measurement. Here on the board you can see various things that can be measured. First thing on the list is putting. Right now is a great time to get out and start measuring so you have a barometer of where you are to start the new year. With the weather getting a little bit better, it's good to see where you are so you know what to practice and what to work on as the year goes on. So under putting, I have three foot putts, five foot putts, and 10 foot putts. And in this example, out of 10, I just tracked how many I made. So nine out of 10, seven out of 10, and five out of 10. You can track it out of five putts, out of 10 putts, out of 15, whatever you're comfortable with but that just gives you some data there to start your year off. If you're really detailed, you can do it from three, four, five, six, seven, every number up to 10 feet, and then you'll have a lot of numbers and you'll know which areas you need to practice, such as maybe you're good from five feet and not good from six feet. So that's an example of something you can practice in putting. And then in short game, I have written down chips, pitch, and flops, and these are up and downs. So out of 10, again, eight out of 10 chipping, in this example, 6 out of 10 pitching and 4 out of 10 with flops, getting those up and down. You could also track just proximity, how many you get within 10 feet, how many you get within 5 feet. Basically, you can measure anything. And then down here, full swing, so on the driving range, this is proximity, as you see in this example, 15 feet, hitting shots to a 100-yard target, 125-yard target, to 150 yard target, just seeing how many you get within 15 feet. So in this example, eight out of 10 from 100, seven out of 10 from 125, and five out of 10 from 150. An easy way to tell about 15 feet, if you picture uh, two flag sticks on the ground, a flag stick is about seven feet, so kind of picture two flag sticks out there in the driving range, and that'll give you roughly 15 feet. You can make your box bigger, you can make your box smaller, depending on your skill level. Maybe for your skill level, you need to set your box at 30 feet. That's fine. So basically you can measure anything. Putting, short game, full swing, you can measure uh, anything from distance to accuracy um, throughout, your, throughout your golf bag. So go out there, start measuring, and that'll give you a good sense of where you need to focus your time for 2018. I'm Josh Apple, and that's your tip of the day.